hello everyone welcome back to my channel oh my goodness i've missed you guys so much and let me tell you we have some tea your girl is engaged kyle and i got engaged on christmas eve super exciting so what better way to come back than letting you guys know that your girl has been beyonce beyonce okay but anyways um i've been gone for a while and i didn't mean to go on a hiatus just so much has been going on but I do want to show you guys everything about the engagement. Um, I will be doing a video with Kyle and getting like his side and story and all the planning and whatnot. And also the proposal video will be coming soon. Go from your telescope, take me on this journey home. I don't want to wait no new hi my name is Alexis Danielle and I am the founder and CEO of Christian Girl Next Door Ministries where I help you lovely ladies to define and beautify your walk with Christ through fashion faith and femininity don't forget to hit that subscribe button join the fam follow us on social media Christian Girl Next Door in sync Kyle and I got engaged during the Christmas break he came home from medical school and did I know that we were gonna get engaged um for Kyle and I it was always something that we talked about we knew off the bat that we wanted to get married very early on we really did discuss getting engaged and what it would look like because around the time that we met he was doing his master's program and in medical school so it's just been a lot of transitioning within like the six months a little bit over than that so it's we've been through a lot of transitions within the last year but we knew that we were gonna make the long distance work we knew that God put him in my life and he confirmed some things to me that he was my husband and he confirmed to him which that's gonna be a whole other story if you guys want to hear that we will elaborate but I just feel weird sharing that story if he's not here to share his part yes we knew very early on that we wanted to get engaged we went looking for engagement rings before we hit a year so I think that's also really important to let the person that you're dating and if you're dating intentionally we both were dating with the intention of wanting to get married of wanting a family so on and so forth but if you want to get married or you want a serious relationship, let the guy know. Um, I was very, very, very straightforward with Kyle when we first started dating. I'm, I pretty much said I want a husband and I could have ran him off, but he stuck by me. So we love that. Kyle's a man of his word and we talked about it, you know, being engaged by the end of the year, by the end of 2021. I'm nosy and I'm a little detective so knowing that he comes home for Christmas break it had to be between somewhere between Christmas Eve and New Year's and maybe even a little bit after New Year the engagement I will post little pictures here it was very personal like it was really an Alexis and Kyle engagement he had my aunt there and my mom you know and his family it was something really intimate Kyle even documented some things and he even put a little sprinkle of Kyle because he loves Legos and he added some Legos in there and um, balloons because he knows that I love to take pictures and document things. So it was really intimate. Um, it was at his house and when I walked in, initially we were going to go, the plan was to go eat at a restaurant. I was starving by the way. I was like, oh my goodness, I'm hungry when I finally got there and... I walked in and there was roses on the floor the mom his mom was recording and she's like follow the roses so I followed the roses and everyone was outside and he was sitting there and he looked so cute and I was like oh my goodness it's happening which I was thinking after we eat dinner because I was hungry <laughs> and honestly I wasn't nervous but I was nervous and not in a bad way. I knew I was going to say yes, like this person, like Kyle, I love him so much. Like we hate doing the long distance. Like it was going to be a yes. I was really comfortable saying yes. There were so many things going through my head where if you guys see the video, you guys might think like, oh, Alexis isn't excited. But I was excited. I just had so many things going through my hair, going through my hair, going through my head. I said hair because my hair was straight and it was cloudy. It was dark and oh my goodness, and my hair was getting frizzy. So I was like doing this while I was trying to take pictures. And it, 
it we had little hiccups you know with every with anything there's gonna be little hiccups but you know looking back i wouldn't have it any other way it was super intimate it was all kyle like sprinkles of kyle and alexis and i wouldn't want it any other way um wish that i wasn't so worried about the pictures and just little things like that where i really was able to enjoy the moment because it just flew by and it wasn't till the next day that like it really hit me that i am his fiance and god really like came through on things that he's told me we exchanged gifts after that the families did and it was just amazing i love that it was small and it was intimate and it was exactly alexis and kyle because social media makes you Think that it needs to be something extravagant and at the end of the day i don't think i would want something so extravagant and just realizing that it's not about that it's about you know him making the promise that we're gonna get married and the union of being married and i'm just super excited for the union of getting married and seeing where god is going to take us because he has he has big plans for us very much noted one of my favorite things was the little Legos. Uh, let me bring my little. I can really see how God has prepared me to enter this new season of engagement and also like preparing me to be a wife. I will be doing a video on that because you guys know that I love femininity and there's some things in femininity that there's a lot of things that femininity, homemaking and being a wife and running a home really is practical that's why i love femininity it's not just about looking good but i've really seen god work um and i'm super happy that i'm engaged to my best friend that the long distance is almost over so i know i'm gonna get a question when are we gonna get married we decided to get married the third year the end of his third year of medical school so time is flying by he will be done with his first year of medical school soon and then summertime he will be going into his second year so time is flying by and it also helps me prepare my school and everything because i will be moving so there's just going to be a lot of transitions. Just super excited. Um, there's not going to be any like wedding content till later down the line. I might show you guys little things that I buy here and there. But other than that, I'm super excited, super blessed. God has really allowed me and given me a wonderful man who loves him. And loves me as Christ loves the church. And that just means so much to me. And I'm beyond grateful. Sometimes I'm in awe of the things that God has done through our me and Kyle's relationship. And if I can tell you girlies anything is to wait. God has someone who is worthy of you. That will love you. That will protect you. God's plan is always better than yours. I just hope that this encourages anyone that who's waiting. Wait on Jesus. I... I'm so beyond grateful for Kyle. I'm so beyond grateful the way that he protects me, he loves me, and the way he leads me in Jesus. And he's literally my best friend. Like, that's all I can say is he's literally my best friend. We have the time of our lives together. I'm a grandma. I can comfortably be a grandma, a grandma chic um, with him. And we are just like two peas in the pod. Like, I love him to death. Yeah, I hope you lovely ladies enjoyed this video. I know, I feel like I was all over the place just because there was bits and pieces and actually me reminiscing on the day. But I love each and every one of you girlies. I am officially back on YouTube. My goal is to upload Mondays and Fridays. So Mondays are going to be like my ministry Mondays and then my Fridays are my modestly feminine Fridays. So that's super exciting where we talk about femininity and like homemaking and um fashion on fridays and then monday it's either like ministry work um what god has been teaching me christian girl talk stuff like that so i love each and every one of you lovely ladies um thank you for everyone who's followed me on my instagram and was able to hear the news first um, thank you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed hit that subscribe button down below content is coming on monday so be prepared for ministry monday i don't really know what that content's gonna be it's either i'm thinking it's gonna be a vlog like i'm really thinking it's gonna be a vlog of like me doing ministry stuff and like the vision for christian girl next door in sync um but and for me rambling on i love each and every one of you lovely ladies again subscribe on my um, christian girl next door instagram and on my prepster alexis for fashion inspo so bye